All right, this is W6FCC again. It's uh, March 19th, Tuesday. There's a question about this V-Audio that's come up again. And let's presume that you have uh, connected to your radio, which you can see here I'm connected to a radio. And uh, I'm going to select the mod setting on the one that I'm collected, connected to. And here is the microphone setting up here. I'm going to move this out of the way. Okay, so as you can see here, we can change the frequency. I need to put this thing back on 205. I don't know how it got 208. Probably me bumping something. Uh, by the way, you can just go ahead and type the frequency in with the uh, keyboard. 7205000. Hit enter, and I'm on 7205. And You'll notice here that when I transmit, I'll go ahead and transmit, testing one, two, three, four, we're fully putting out audio as we're supposed to. Now I'm going to turn the transmit off. Now if you bring up the speech uh, buttons, and I'm going to hit the voice button here, you have some pre-recorded uh, text or speech. You can change those things by clicking on edit and uh, navigating around and finding various uh, speech files that you want to send. Now watch what happens to the microphone radio button when I start to play something. This is from Rich WZ2D. Watch what happens up here and down here and over here. You'll see the transmit button go on. Transmitting. And the reason I'm hearing this is I have the monitor turned on. Actually, I guess you can hear it either way. So this is working, and you notice here this says V-Audio. Now watch what happens when I end that. This V-Audio automatically switched from V-Audio to microphone, and now I can transmit again. I can actually manually set that to V-Audio, and if I transmit now, testing one, two, three, four, nothing is coming through to the scope, but if I change that back to mic, testing one, two, three, four, uh, you, you see things working. Now if I select file and I open up a file, depending on what I have, let me just open up this thing called Danny Green Radio. It's now on file and if I start transmitting it, we can't hear it. But it's going out over the air. Let me see if I hit, uh, if I look at monitor here. No, I'm not able to hear it. But anyway, it is transmitting. So I'm going to pause that, stop that. And if you notice here, this did not go back to microphone, and so I unkey, and it's still on file. So if I now key the transmitter, testing one, two, three, four, I have nothing. So it, this is another area where if you don't select the right modulation, uh, you're not going to be able to actually use the radio with the uh, existing microphone. This normally rests in the mic position and it only jumps to the V-Audio when you play a, a voice message like this one. And we uh, we can play something like so. And that's uh, Steve transmitting um, who brought up this issue. But you notice what happened here when I started transmitting his audio. Okay, so this flips back and forth. And I could probably go find that particular audio by looking here and seeing where I stored it and send it using the file approach. But when the thing is... Uh, sitting and you're ready to use it as a radio normally uh, you need to have the uh, mod select set to microphone so when you do transmit testing one two three four you're actually modulating the uh, radio otherwise you're going to have a very little luck communicating okay w6fcc it's three march 19th 2019 and that would be all I have to say on this subject. Be sure to select this correctly. Have fun.